Hey guys, it's Matt. I'm going to show you how to use Sense within Pro Tools. Here I have High Tom, Low Tom, Tom Room, and Overheads. When I originally recorded this, these were my close mics, the High Tom and the Low Tom. This was a room mic that was placed 10 feet away from the toms, and these are overhead mics, capturing a stereo image over the toms being played. What I'm doing here is using sends in a creative way to make a bus out of them. All of my toms are going to tom sum, which is going over here to tom sum. Now this tom sum is compressing the toms quite a bit and then EQing out all the low end and all the high end to just get the attack. To get the low end of the toms, I'm using buses up here on the high tom and the low tom close mics and the overhead tom mics. Now you can see tom bus is going to the tom bus over here. And on this track, I'm using a compressor and I'm using an EQ to get a lot of the bottom end and girth to my toms. So what this means now is on my toms, I have my attack and I have my bottom end and I can mix them freely together and pan them. And how I'm doing this is I'm panning the attack towards the center and I'm panning the bottom and girth out towards the sides. This creates a wide stereo image for these toms. Join the conversation by following Wink Sound on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube to keep up with everything you need to know about music and audio technology. Yeah. <laughs>